Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Substriker Army and home homies alike. My name is Jacob as always, and boy does it feel great to be in the winter circle again. It is a Friday night, I'm recording this. It's pretty damn great is all I have to say. But ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, Hopefully we're gonna pull don't lose Pokemon again because that way I don't lose Lugia because I'm gonna be down to one legendary Pokemon and Michael's gonna have like five potential ones to bring in. I don't really want that unless we pull the one percent legendary Pokemon. Let's spin the wheel and see what happens. Oh, oh, oh this is this is pretty big. This is pretty big. We get to evolve a Pokemon. Now chat, we have a lot of different options. I'm not sure what I'm going. I don't know. We're gonna evolve a Pokemon and probably pick a Pokemon that's a first stage Pokemon. We're gonna see what happens. Uh, I don't know fully what I wanna do. We shall see. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's go. Let's, oh, I have, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I have to use it against him, right? Mega Blaziken against Michael? That's gotta happen, right? I have to use Mega Blaziken against Michael. Like, it's in the cards. I'm very tempted to do this. We'll see what happens. Okay, now it's time for my favorite generation. And now we'll see what our starters are going to be. <laughs> oh my gosh, you got Zero Aura! Okay, yeah, we're going with that. Yep, all right, yep, we're taking that one. All right, sweet. It's time to look at our starters. Let's see if there is an Alola Pokemon in our starter selection. I really, if I get a Magearna, I might scream very loudly. And I, it, luckily it's only 5.30 in the evening. So if I scream loudly, it's not gonna matter. My neighbors can't be upset if I scream loudly at 5.30, but. <gasps> <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Woo, woo, woo! Oh. Oh, 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 oh! Sorry, I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I'm so excited. Okay, no, this is not, uh, no, this is not a first encounter type of, well, I mean, well, it is, well, it is an encounter. It's, yeah, no, we got a young goose. Woo, yeah! <laughs> oh, let's see what my encounter is gonna be, chat. It is going to be a grubbin. Is that not randomized? Wow, yeah, please give us something better. Okay, I mean, I can't necessarily use that right now, though. It's a it's a Rowlet, but okay, I mean, that's fine. <gasps> oh, a Drapa! Yo! Wait. A <gasps> Did I just see? Is that a contrary Drapa? Oh, baby, Draco me! Oh, it's broken! <laughs> Michael's in so much trouble. Or Corio. Hmm, okay, well... Yeah, it's, it's it's something. It's really something, chat. All right. Ooh, and a Rankaroo, you know. I, you know what? I'll take it. What else we got? A Steeny. Oh, these Pokemon are so bad. Anyway, let's see if I can find more Lola Pokemon. Woo! Come on. I caught a Gumshoes. Hi, Gumshoes. Okay, a Rangaroo. I mean, I, I, oh, that's Grassy Surge. Now that is kind of interesting. Not gonna lie. And a Rowlet. That's an Eidolon. You know what? That's oh, not a Rowlet. A Dartrix. Oh my gosh. You know, this is just more of a reason why I dislike Sun and Moon in Gen Seven. That is a Steeny. That is our last Pokemon. Good abilities here. Corrosion. I don't think that's gonna be very helpful in Zero Aura. No, that's not gonna be very helpful. But okay, whatever. Next up is a Moxie Young Goose. Okay. A Scrappy Rowlet, which that's interesting, but it'd been nice if it was a Decidueye. Oracorio with Super Luck. A Steenie with Flower Veil, which actually is kind of fitting. And lastly, a Rangaroo is Grassy Surge. That's right. All right, well, that's all. That's all of our Pokemon, which, okay, well, we at least got one Pokemon we can work with here. And maybe, I guess, one and a half. So, uh, yeah, um, I'll see you over at Team Building. All right. We are in the PC right now. We have a Soundproof Steeny, a Honey Gather Grubbin, obviously Contrary Drampa, Sheer Force Pissimian, oh, Storm Drain Gumshoes, and a Solid Rock Dartrix. So we got some building to do. We got a lot of fun things to do. My, our team's going to look very, very different, and I'm excited. I hope you guys enjoy. See you soon.
Okay, team build. Um, so, uh, starting off, we got Alan, aka the Mega Sharpedo. I decided to bring this instead of Diancy, mainly because of the fact that he's probably already expecting Diancy. And also, last round, I kind of put myself at a disadvantage by making a Legendary and the Mega the same Pokemon. So I was able to only bring in two OP Pokemon when Jakey could bring in three. So in hindsight, that wasn't the smartest idea. So that's why I decided to bring Mega Sharpedo here. It has Technician, which boosts the, any move that has a base power of 60 or below by 1.5 times. So because of that, I decided to bring Aqua Jet and Bite. So that will, those will both do more damage in general. Actually, Aqua Jet may not do as much, but it's still priority. It's going to hit hard. Bite will be better than Crunch with Technician. So that's, that's why I did that. Then Earthquake and Ice Fang. Next up is Grand Mazera Aura holding the Electrium Z. We'll both have a Z item on one of our Pokemon in this battle. And as the Corrosion Abilities, which like I said, it's not going to be very useful. Well, at least that's what I said in the uh, catching video. And we got Plaza Fist, Close Combat, Bulk Up, and Fake Out. Pretty self-explanatory moveset. I decided to have Fake Out on there just to do a little chip damage when it comes in and then just hit hard. In case there's like a few variables there where I could uh, I could actually like do a little bit of chip damage and then get it into range of killing, so I thought that was a good idea. Next up is our boy Bill the Dragonite holding the Life Orb with a Neuro Force ability, which essentially makes it have like an expert belt, but more OP. And it has Thunder Punch, Earthquake, Dragon Dance, and Roost, and it did maintain its adamant nature from the randomized uh, website that gives it a new randomized uh, nature, so very nice. Next up is Danny, the Ferrothorn with the Aka Berry with Overgrow ability with Stealth Rocks, Leech Seed, and Power Up and Protect. I chose Aka Berry this time because last time I should have did that to begin with. But yet again, I also didn't expect Flamethrower on a Mega Manectric. So yeah, I don't know. I should have thought of that, but I forgot about that. So it is what it is. So now we have it on it. Next up is Brent the Regigigas uh, with a Damp ability holding the leftovers with Toxic, Knock Off, Drain Punch, and Return. Because there's no slow start, things just going to be quick and hit everything hard. Especially with Drain Punch, being able to heal up and then, you know, just as well as doing damage. It's, it's going to be really, really nice. And um, I don't know if Jakey will expect Regigigas to show up just because I didn't bring it the last couple times. I mean, he might, but as far as uh, I feel like this is kind of more of a secret in a way because, yeah, I don't think he thinks that I'm going to be bringing Regigigas. He thinks I'm going to be bringing Diancy again. I just feel it. But, anyways, lastly, we got Michaela the Gudra with the Flame Orb with the Quick Feed ability. So, if it has a static infl or a status inflicted on it, which will be, uh, it will be burned and it will, uh, its speed will go up 1.5 times. And it's going to have Draco Meteor, Facade, uh, Thunderbolt, and Fire Blast. So, that's my team. Ah, <sighs> Jakey said that he has a crazy team. And, uh, yeah, we'll see how this, uh, battle goes. But anyways, I'll see you guys over at the battle. Hello, ladies and gentlemen of Strike Army. Welcome to the Team Builder for Generation 7. We have randomized our ability for Gens 1 and 2. And, oh my goodness, we also decided we're going to evolve our Torchic to a Blaziken for one specific reason. Mega Blaziken has an insane ability that's all i'm gonna say but we have a uh, grassy surge on brand with toxic moonlight which follow play with the leftovers and it randomized to a bold nature which is great then we have ghostinium z ash the lunala with trick room moon geist beam moon blast and psychic moon blast is just to hit that sharpedo and the dark eye i suppose as well so that's really important um kind of afraid of certain things like dark cry but if he doesn't bring Darkrai, this is such an insane Pokemon versus Michael. So, yeah. Next up, we got Moon, the Suicune. Uh, we have Michael slash Miguel, the Mega Blaziken. So, I didn't want to have two Michaels on the team. So, we switched Suicune's nickname to Moon because I know Moon loves water types and we don't have a Moon yet. So, yeah. Toxic Ice Moon is called uh, Roar. I might just change Toxic for something else. Um, not sure what I'd want to run. Uh, we'll, we'll do Signal Beam in case he decides to bring that Sharpedo. Uh, gotta be prepared for that as much as we can. Um, next up we have Mega Blaziken with Wonder Guard! This is going to be amazing. Because if he doesn't bring Flying or Ground Coverage on that Dragonite, he can't touch us. Swords and Flame Charge, High Jump Kick, Stone Edge is like perfect neutral coverage versus his entire team. That's pretty scary. 
This is insane. This is an insane Pokemon. Genuinely. Such a good Pokemon. Um, this could just sweep his team out, right? Uh, I won't lead with it. But it's pretty brutal for him. That's all I'm going to say. And obviously we have the contrary drop out. This is a pseudo-Dragonite check. With a Bonberry. So, yeah. We have Draco. Uh, I wanted to potentially bring Dragonium Z, but I think Habanberry is just better to check the Dragonite. So yeah, Defog in case he tries to set up hazards. Uh, I don't have any hazards on my team this week, so I'm okay with bringing Defog. Uh, Roost, obviously. Uh, this is insane. Energy Ball plus Grassy Surge. Dragon plus Grass hits everything pretty well. Uh, this is the problem for him. And then we have a Choice Scarf, Sheer Forest, Pissimian. Rockside Iron has really good coverage uh, and new turn close combat. Uh, this is like a check to his Regigigas and his Dark Ride. And Sharpedo even. It's a really good check to so many Pokemon on his team. And unless his Dragonite has Jolly Nature, we outspeed plus one Dragonite and Rockside will do a lot of damage. So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let's get to the battle. Short team builder from my end. All right. Ladies and gentlemen of Strike Army, my name is Jacob, as always, and welcome to the battle portion of Michael's favorite generation of all time, Generation 7. I'm being sarcastic if you didn't know Michael hates Generation Only on 7. April 1st. Only on April 1st. Did you know April 1st doesn't actually exist, so you actually stated that you love Generation 7? Um, that's... you're full of crap. That's what that is. How am I full of crap? Because there's always an April 1st, Jakey. Not April Fool's, though. Anyway, I digress. How are you feeling oh about Generation gosh. 7? Did you get any good Pokemon? I got one. Then all the rest were crap. Oh. <laughs> I am bringing three. Literal crap. I, my team, uh, you have seen yep. two Pokemon, I think. And that's it. Mm. So. Um, You've only... seen... Three. Oh, I'm Five excited! <laughs> so. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy, send that challenge, please. I am super okay. excited. You are going to be... You're probably going to shit your pants. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, when you realize something? Oh, you will 100% shit your pants. Oh, I'm probably just going to have to punch you. Hey, do you see anything? Huh? Do you see anything? Oh, Mega Blaziken. Oh, I have a Mega Blaziken. I do. Uh, so that's interesting. Oh, wait, did you get evolution? I did. Oh. And I wasn't necessarily going to do Blaziken, but I saw its mega ability, and I had to. Mm. That's all I'm Okay, then you got a Lunalo, which, okay, that's cool. And that then, was my uh, starter. A Drapa. Yeah. Oh, that was your starter? Yeah, my starter was Zeraora. Oh, yeah, definitely. And then after that, I got all crap from my wild encounters. So... so. You're bringing in Danny, so you are bringing Hazard, so that's pretty important. I guess and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to lead... I'm thinking I'm just going to lead this. I'm tempted just to lead this. Cool. Eh, okay. okay. Well. I still don't remember your ability from that, honestly. Hmm. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Because that actually low-key is a major threat to this team. Pissimian? Pretty much. Oh, no, I knew it was. Because you had all your legends, like, just got, like, couldn't switch in. Like, your two yeah. prime, like, just, it was a problem. I, no I noticed uh, you had a nice Zerora over there. Is that the only good mod you got? That's literally the only thing I got. That was my starter. Um, I basically brought all my good Pokemon. Um, wait till oh, you see okay. some of their abilities, too. It's kind of ridiculous. Okay. Oh, you stayed in, okay. Um, I guess this is pretty fair. Oh, grassy terrain. Okay. That's interesting, because the funny thing is, I actually did get a grassy terrain Pokemon. Oh, you did? What was yours? Um, Crap, what was it? I don't remember. Okay. I, I honestly mean... don't remember. Oh, wait, no! I think it was a... I got an Orangaroo. I think that's what it was. That got, oh, that's funny. I that got grassy Simeon terrain. and you got an Orangaroo. That's pretty funny. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's see, what do you got? Oh, Moonlight. Lovely. I'm just scouting out this moveset, to be honest. Okay. Okay. Oh, you got Intimidate. Wow. Ooh, you had Toxic. Okay, okay. That's not ideal. 
Oh, that thing could okay. be kind of problem. Yeah, well, now you know my moveset. Yeah, I needed that. Alright, so now I'm just gonna do this. Mm. Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Ooh! Interesting. Interesting, yes. Yeah. <clears throat> Oh! Okay. That's something. <laughs> problem! That's a problem, yeah, that's a big problem. Oh, uh, okay. Wait. Well, okay, well, that's great. Now. Um, boy, you okay. You haven't seen anything yet, buddy. Well, uh. Oh, what do I even do? You have two fighting types. Oh, this is so, so frustrating. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh my god. This is so bad. Oh, oh my gosh. It doesn't even matter abilities. This is just an issue in general. Oh yeah. Um, you weren't expecting this because I didn't I have it. Oh, that lived. Okay. Mm. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Damn it, you got the double protect. That's okay. That's fine. I, I, you know, it's all good. I was hoping you didn't get the double protect. Okay. It's, it's all right. Well, that's, that's all right. At least. That is. Yeah, so. Yeah, you clearly have uh, Aqua Jet on that, so. All right. That's fine. Oh, yep. what the? <laughs> what the heck? Oh, oh you, my you, gosh! Uh... All right, well. Wait, wait. Oh, nice. Okay, that's fine. Oh, flame orb. Yeah. Either your guts or your like marble scale, and you're special with marble scale. Maybe. Oh, you'll see. Ugh, this is not good. <clears throat> Guess we'll see. I guess I... I'm gonna do this. Oh! <laughs> Wonder Guard! Yup! <laughs> oh my god! You better hope you have the... You better hope you have Earthquake, buddy. I, I mean, I have Earthquake, but... Wow! Well, why would you tell me that? Well, no, not on this. Oh, okay. Well, I still told you, but... <sighs> Question is, who do I go to? Yeah, Wonder Guard Blaziken uh, is a problem. Okay, well, bye bye. <laughs> damn it! Oh, that's so bad. I had to go okay. for that. I mean, I was like, oh, you got the flying move, Earthquake. That's the only thing I can think of. Um, I guess we we'll just do this. Oh uh, well, yeah. that's fine. This could be a problem. <sighs> this could be a problem for sure, but um, yeah, Wonder Guard, you gotta be kidding me. Well, you've earthquake on this, bro. Yeah, I know, but foul play is gonna do a lot of damage, though. Mm, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Oh, this is such a tough match, dude. Ah, oh. that did so that's, much. That, that's still the. Oh my gosh. All right, well, I know that wall's that, but I think you're gonna click that. I, I gotta, I gotta get this. Thing. Oh, ah! Oh. I thought, I thought, I was I, yeah. I, I need, was thinking I you were gonna try to predict me to go for a drain punch. And yeah, then I was gonna... this thing is a problem. No, I get it. This thing's a problem. I thought you were gonna toxic me. I'm like, I need to get this thing on timer, or it's gonna mm. become a problem. Well, okay, so that's pretty important. I'll just do this. Ugh. Stupid. I thought you were gonna click toxic, but <sighs> that really sucks. My Sharpedo is gone. Yeah, because now that really sucks. Yeah, the Aqua Jet always checked it. I mean, at this point, 
I think I just do that, to be honest. Yeah. 29, so 130, 195, like 97, 200, it was like 58. I can't let you set up. That's fine, that's fine, that's All fine. Right. Oh, thank God. That thing still did so much work. All your life will yeah. be okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, what was interesting about that was that it was Neuroforce. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, I will tell you, if, if some of the abilities don't pop up, I will tell you. Okay. Um, now, what would be next? Uh... Hmm. Um, I need to do this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's fair. Oh, no, you're faster? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait a minute. Oh, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Okay, so you have plasma fit. Oh, Electrium Z. Oh, let's oh go. it didn't kill. Let's go, Ash. Let's go. Let's go. It didn't kill. Oh, oh my baby, God. The is broken. Oh, that's because oh. I have the intimidate though too, and the knowledge is super bulky. Mm, okay. Uh, uh. Uh. Let's see. Okay. Um. I think I'm gonna go to this. Okay. That's fine. Mm, I, I just have to play this super safe. I think I just do this, to be honest. I mean, let's see, if foul play does a lot. If foul play does a lot, that means, uh, or more than I think, it, that means you're not Marvel scale. Okay, your guts. That didn't do it. Yeah, you're, you're absolutely guts. Oh yeah, I should know your guts, Gudra. You told do me you? last time. No. You didn't tell me, or wait, are you not guts? No. All right, is this Marvel scale? No. What ability are you? Well, after this dies, tell me. What ability are you? It had quick feet. Oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I'm getting destroyed. This is ridiculous. <laughs> well, to be fair, I did oh. have a pretty broken thing. Okay. It's pretty much over at this point. Yeah, I'm scarfed, pissy man, because I knew I'd need it for all your threats. Like, it checked Sharpedo, it checked Darkrai, it checked Reggie. Dude, what the? I did and, not... oh, it still lived. Okay. Oh. oh, GG, dude, GG. Holy crap. Wow, I got slaughtered two weeks in a row. <laughs> oh, I'm and this sorry. time it wasn't, it wasn't even a misplay. It wasn't even a misplay. I just got. St oh. Well, to be Bad fair, I got with... really broken stuff. So, they either can get rid of my Wonder Guard Ma Mega Blaziken for you, for Gen 8, or they can get rid of Lunala, which they won't do, because its name is Ash, and no. I'm just kidding, anyway. I, <laughs> wow. Oh, by the yeah, way. Yeah, no, I, I already know how this is going to turn out next week, because I don't have anything to match up oh, against this. I have a proposition Frickin for Gen you. Freaking Gen 7. I hate Gen 7. <laughs> this is more of a reason why I hate Gen 7. Worst Gen ever. Okay, I want to I I say something. What? So I want to have a proposition for you to make sure no matter what happens next week, say I do win, it'll be up five to three. I want to yeah. have a proposition for you. Uh, Gen nine or the the win. So we have the next mat battle we have after Gen eight, winner take all, for three points. Okay. So yeah, that I, was, I thought we were I thought we were doing that initially, anyways. Oh, I didn't know if we had talked about it. I guess. Oh, that, that way uh, I next I was week. Assuming that. that way next week doesn't matter, and then whoever wins the final battle with like twenty Pokemon that we bring or whatever we're bringing, I don't know how many we're bringing. Right, a lot so of Pokemon. We're, so we'd be bringing the full team. How do we even? Not do that? all the Pokemon that we have. We'd be bringing. I'll show you, but we'll, we'd be bringing like sixteen Pokemon or something. Whatever we decide, oh. we feel we can, and we have item claws too, so that'd be really interesting. But um, I do want to say something. I also yeah. have a contrary drama with Draco Meteor. 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> that I didn't even get to use. Uh, but I, yeah, no, my... Keep so, uh, my Sharpedo was Technician. Oh, okay, that's interesting. So yeah, if Wait, I Wait, why did you bring Mega Diancy? Okay, here's my mindset behind this. Yeah. It's because if I, if I chose Diancy, then that takes up a Mega and a Legendary in one Pokemon. So I I'd only be able to bring two. O I would have only brought two OP Pokemon versus three. I would not had two legendaries and a Mega. I guess that's that. That mindset makes sense. Yeah, I can I can get behind that mindset. By the so way, that's uh, why I didn't bring it. No, that makes sense. So, um, by the way, Pissimian's uh, ability was Sheer Force. Oh, great. Yeah. Wow. So I uh, got yeah, those. Those are my like, three good Pokemon. The rest of the Pokemon weren't the best. I got that Grubbin, and then I immediately ran into a Vikavolt, so I was like, okay, same as Gen 6 oh. with Frogadier to Greninja. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, yeah, you, you're gonna love the ones I got. So first, my starter, which was good. Uh -huh. Zerora. Oh, you got and a Legends I got, too. I got Lunala, and I yeah. was pretty hyped. Yeah. Young Goose. Oh, I got a Gumpy. That's funny. And then I had a Rowlet, but then later I found a Decidueye. That's so funny. So I, I got Dark Tricks. Wow, it's like we're copying each other in this. And then Oracorio, which is the fire one. Eh, and then really... I got a I got a Steeny, and then a Rangaroo. <gasps> you got a, a Steeny too? <laughs> you got a Rangaroo. Oh I got Pissimi, and we got Steeny. Oh my god, it's like we are mirrored pretty much. That yeah, is so much. weird, dude. That is Except so then weird. you got OP. You got some OP Pokemon though. I got all okay, crap. Okay, is pretty. <laughs> Zerora is pretty good. It just, yeah, it sucked because I, I of course I had Lu intimidate Lunala. Of course I did. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. But I, um, I was Habanberry Drampa specifically for Dragonite, uh -oh. so that way, uh -oh. yeah, I could take the hit and then Draco Meteor you. I didn't even bring a Dragon move on it. <gasps> you didn't. Okay, so I, I, I definitely would have lived to hit then. No, I I had Earthquake, Thunder Punch, Dragon Dance, and Roost. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I get that. But yeah, Lunala is very threatening. So next gen, we're are we allowing Dynamax? I nah, feel... I mean it's a part. I mean we did Z move. Yeah. How I about mean, this? How about this? For the Gen Eight, we can. But for Gen for the final battle, no, only Megas. No. Okay. Yeah. We only can. Yeah, bring I think a that Mega. makes sense. Yeah, we can bring a Mega for this, but we can't Dynamax a Mega though. That's not. Allowed. Well, yeah. Anything else busted. can Dynamax? Yeah, no, it'd be way too good. Especially with Protean Diancy. I don't want to deal with that. Protean Mega Diancy. Mm, uh, I would rather not. Oh, wait. Yeah, so that, yeah, we only have one Mega, and then you'd have. So we would have everything, so no legendary limitations and all that other stuff, too. Yeah, so it's yeah, just... for the final battle, no legend limitations. And it's going to be a wild time, to say the least. Oh, boy. In the final okay. battle, but next week will be Gen Eight. We'll be getting our final Pokemon, and I think that'll be pretty good, dude. Uh, but yeah, okay. GG again. Um, I get one GG. more. You might get one last spin, spin the wheel thing though. By the way, so if you win next week, you mm. still get that spin the wheel for Gen Eight. So you could pull like a oh. full, fully evolved mon like Dragapult, Dragapult, or a single stage mon like Dragazolt or Drag of you know, pretty, mm -hmm. pretty yeah. stuff good stuff that you don't have to tell me about but yeah i thought it was cool yeah. that i got the mega blaziken so yeah wonder guard oh my gosh it's just funny that i had the wonder guard torpedo and then when it became a mega it lost wonder guard and basically you pass it on to blaziken i okay to be fair i was not i was not i was gonna evolve the vigoroth into slacking because then it would have been like i had three legends on my team but then i saw mega blaziken's ability i'm like can I really justify doing this? No, I can't. So I didn't. Wow. <laughs> so I had to do Mega Blaziken. Oh, man. You definitely didn't hold back this week. So that's... No. Wow. All right. Well, uh, there's that. So. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great day. We love you all. Peace. See you all next time.